So I see a lot of people who come into a lot of people come into the pharmacy who are taking metformin, and they still feel off. They often complain of brain fog or not being as sharp as they used to be. Well, there's a reason for this, and it's not just getting older. It's most likely the metformin nutrient drain. Let me explain. So when people are struggling with their insulin levels, their doctors typically put them on metformin. So in the beginning, they will feel great. Most, most will lose some weight and in general feel good. Shortly after that, they may start experiencing numbness and tingling in fingertips or toes. I also see patients who have been a metformin for a while and their memory has been getting a little bad. They may also be experiencing some brain fog and some bad appetite. Other symptoms might be some confusion or even slight memory loss. Sadly, people will chalk us up to getting older and they don't always make the connection that it, it could be nutrient depletion from taking metformin. So we sell a lot of drugs for diabetic neuropathy and neuropathy in general. But for many years, we never made the connection that drugs like metformin can deplete the body of B12 and folic acid. So we learn about B12 and folic acid being the causes of anemia and neuropathy, but we never put the two and two together until more recent years. In fact, they used to think that people get diabetic neuropathy because they are told that their sugars weren't well controlled in their blood, and this was impacting their nerve endings. But now we know it really is from B12 and folic acid depletion. So many people were struggling with symptoms like neuropathy because we recommended metformin to every, pretty much every diabetic or pre-diabetic because it's the best drug on the market for lowering your blood sugar without the added side effects of low sh blood sugar or, or hypoglycemia. So it's pretty safe for people to take and it doesn't cause weight gain like all the other diabetic medications do. So usually it's the first choice for anybody with depression. So if you're a diabetic, you're probably going to go on metformin and there's a possibility that you could be on it for the rest of your life. So when people are very deficient, they won't be able to replenish from just their diet alone. So this is why it's crucial to supplement correctly with B12 and also know which type of B12 to take. And to go deeper on the topic of metformin and neuropathy, sign up for my free 20 minute discovery call where we can discuss your specific situation. Simply click the button below this video.